what is up guys, it's Tam River here with your weekly Fortnite news and updates. Before we get started, let's set a like goal of 100 likes. Can we please get 100 likes, Tam Nation? If we do, one lucky person in the comments down below will have a chance to win $10 Amazon gift card. All you have to do is subscribe to the channel, give this video a like, and leave a comment down below. Guys, guys, this is an interesting week in Fortnite news. Epic has just announced this new poster for Season 6. It looks pretty sick, and with the limited amount of news that has been coming out regarding Season 6, this is leading to a lot of fan speculation. Now, Fortnite's Twitter posted this image with the caption, All parties need a DJ. Is that a hint for the theme of Season 6? Are we getting like a music theme? It would be cool if we get more DJ skins, maybe something like Marshmallow. Are we finally gonna get the Hotline Bling Dance emo? What do you guys think? Also, in the background, you can see Kevin the Cube. Is he coming back? What's inside? Maybe it's a giant music box. Guess we have to wait until Season 6 before we can find out. In other Fortnite news, guys, the Fortnite Fall skirmish kicked off last week with some minor controversy revolving around the new popular Twitch streamer Nate Hill and Funk Bomb. There was this moment in the fall skirmish when Funk Bomb was eliminated and he proceeded to go on Fortnite stream, which was not delayed, and started telling Nate Hill the positions of the other players and their health. West on the bottom. No help. Cannot edit. Now, Epic today has sent Nate Hill an email and he responded to it on the stream stating that he was suspended for two weeks and Funk Bomb has been removed off of the team and banned from the Fortnite Fall Skirmish, excluding TwitchCon. As the teammate and beneficiary, I'll be suspended immediately from participating in all the skirmish trials and skirmishes until conclusion of suspension October 11th. Still a member of Dusty Dog Club and will remain eligible for club prizing in a false skirmish. Funk is kicked out of Funk is kicked out of Dusty Dogs effective immediately. Will not be eligible for club prizing, but he can go to TwitchCon and play in the TwitchCon tournament. It's only two weeks, but what the f I didn't, I didn't fuck. Now many streamers are saying that this is a form of cheating regardless if Nate Hill did anything with the information provided to him. Now it could still have influenced his decision making throughout the game. Now some people are saying that Epic should have had a delay on this stream and that it was their fault. What do you guys think? I personally think that Nate Hill should have tried to stop Funk Bomb from telling him any more information. I do understand that it is difficult in the heat of the moment for Nate Hill to be doing that, but the whole situation could have been avoided. Now guys, guys, in the comments down below let me know what do you think about this whole situation do you think the punishment was too harsh or do you think the punishment was fair hey time nation and other interesting fortnite news did you know the battle horn released this week had a second sound check out this clip what yeah there's battle going on northwest did you hear that uh, I see. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to leave a comment down below, subscribe to the channel, and give this video a like. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.